the subject matter of geography is creating or sharing knowledge with the learner both in physical geography as well as in the human geography but the most important area in geography is the man environment interaction so here we have certain approaches which create interest among the learner now we have uh, the map of the world which shows the major uh, land masses so or the continent today call we call it the continents the asia the largest one uh, closer to asia is the europe uh, the north america so these are the northern continent of the world the southern continents are south america africa and australia so uh, these are the six continents major continents which have settlements of the human but the seventh continent is uh, antarctica which is actually covered with the ice so again we have certain uh, areas of the world which are disputed um, uh, in smaller regions so the, we have the best example of the asian continent where we have the smaller regions of the world like uh, south asia the southeastern part of the asia the east asia so these are the eastern regions of the asia and the 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 north america has the central part which is called the central american continent so this actually subject create knowledge in physical areas of the world also the physical map of the world shows ocean continents islands mountain plains and deserts so this map shows the major land masses again but the major land masses have different colors like green color shows the areas which are under forest land these two areas are the rain forest areas and the indonesian islands are also under the rain forest why because yahan jo hai wo rain duniya mein sabse zyada hoti hai aur even precipitation is more than evaporation so that's why we have the thick forest here और ये भी यहाँ मैं बताता चलूँ कि यहाँ पर जो हैबिटेट्स हैं या जो कम्युनिटी है एनिमल्स की प्लांट की और इवन इंसेक्ट्स और अदर लाइफ्स की वो दुनिया में सबसे ज्यादा है यहाँ पर हेक्टर स्पीशीज 40 के करीब हैं वेयर एज अदर पार्ट लाइक जो मिडल एटीट्यूड है यहाँ पर पर हेक्टर लाइफ जो स्पीशीज की सूरत में मौजूद है वो लेस देन टेन है so it means that we have more life in those areas which are under moisture or under warm areas so light jo color aapko yahan par nazar aa raha hai that is actually the areas which are under deserts ye duniya ka sabse bada saharai ilaka hai jise hum great sahara kehte hain uske bilkul closer area jo hai wo arabian desert hai same latitudes pe hum dekh rahe hain ki pakistan mein yahan par cholistan और इसी तरह से इंडिया में राजस्थान सो दीज आर द एरियाज विच आर अंडर ड्रोट और यहाँ पर बारिशें कम होती हैं सो दैट्स वाई यहाँ पर जो लाइफ है वो बहुत कम मौजूद है सो थर्ड द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट जो फिजिकल मैप को देखने के बाद हमें जो चीजें नजर आती हैं दोज आर एक्चुअली द माउंटेन एरिया सो द नॉर्दर्न पार्ट ऑफ एशिया विच इज एक्चुअली अंडर द वर्ल्ड हाइएस्ट टॉप्स वो जिसे हम हिमालिया कहते हैं ये दुनिया के सबसे बुलंद तरीन चोटियां भी यहाँ पर मौजूद हैं सो साउथ एशिया जो सी साइड्स आर कवर्ड विद माउंटेन्स सो इज अ माउंटेन लॉक्ड एरिया तो इसी तरह से हम ये देखें यहाँ पर इसके ईस्टर्न हाईलैंड्स हैं नॉर्थ हिमालिया है जो वेस्टर्न साइड इज अगेन कवर्ड विद माउंटेन सो इज अ माउंटेन लॉक्ड एरिया एंड द फोर्थ साइड इसकी जो साउथ एशिया है दैट इज कवर्ड विद वॉटर जिसे हम इंडियन ओशियन कहते हैं the most important aspect of the physical map of the world is to discuss the physical feature so here we have the certain feature which are under very study now this actually map is the physical map of the pakistan shows highlands and lowlands areas as some landforms are under agriculture activity and some are best for other human activities like again the northern part of pakistan is actually covered with highlands so these are the himalayan ranges and the northwestern side is covered with the highest top of pakistan which is k2 so yahan par maujood hai aur ye karakoram range mein hai so the western side of pakistan or slightly north western side is covered with hindu kush range the western side of pakistan is covered with the waziristan hill the koh safed hills the chagi mountains the the central part is covered with 
the Koe Suleiman, the Kirthar Range. So these are the areas which are under the highlands. The lowland of Pakistan actually are the plain areas which are under the uh, river impact. So yahan par jitni bhi agriculture hai are controlled by the uh, rivers. So the agriculture of Pakistan actually um, the backbone of the economy of the country and the um, uh, agricultural jo activities hain wo irrigation se control ho rahi hain aur Pakistan ka jo 70% of the total cultivated land is under irrigation system or the 70% of the cultivation of Pakistan is controlled by the irrigation system. So why? Because of the river. So that's why the rivers are the backbone of the country's economy. Now here, human and animal habitats are generally controlled by climate. Why? Because you see that when the water is warm, or the water is less, 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 so that life is not suitable for most of the life. तो यहां पर हमें चंद जिंदगी के शवायद मिलेंगे और वो जैसे आप देख रहे हैं कि डेजर्ट लाइफ में हमें सिर्फ कैमल जो हैं वो एनिमल में नजर आते हैं बट अदर जो लाइफ्स हैं वो बहुत कम हैं लाइक ह्यूमन की सेटलमेंट्स कम होंगी और यहां पर क्योंकि जिंदगी गुजारना बहुत मुश्किल है सो दैट्स व्हाई सेटलमेंट्स हैं वो बहुत ही स्पॉट्स में नजर आएंगी क्लस्टर में नजर नहीं आएंगी और वहां पर बिग क्लस्टर्स लाइफ के हमें नहीं मिलेंगे so, because water is very difficult for the drinking purpose, even um, domestic uh, life hai, wo suffer by the most important element that is uh, temperature. Temperature se suffer life hoti hai. Whereas penguin jo hai, lives in the Antarctica. Why? Because that kind of animal is only has suitable environment in ice covered areas. So that's why some of the lives are controlled by or, or even the most of the lives are controlled by the climatic condition. So, World population में जब हम देखते हैं कि दुनिया की जो major clusters हैं वो वो दुनिया के उन हिस्सों में मौजूद हैं जहाँ पर आबोहवा साझगार है like जो Asian continent है वहाँ पर most of the clusters जो हैं वो to the eastern side of the Asia में मौजूद हैं like China is one of the largest population of the world it has so the second most important cluster is to the south of the Asia so that has uh, the most, the second most important populous country of the world is India. जैसे कि हम पहले बयान कर चुके हैं कि पाकिस्तान का जो एग्रीकल्चर एरिया है, एग्रीकल्चर जोन वहाँ पर most of the population cluster मौजूद है. So then uh, the second most important cluster is uh, is uh, in the continent of uh, Europe. So it has more than 700 million population. So uh, the third most important area is North America, and and the fourth one is the southern continent. So that has uh, South Asia, uh, Africa and uh, Australia.